Chad Moyer with you here on KTIC and uh, JanFest Farm Show Online at KTICradio.com. One of the exhibitors, Wayne and Barb Oryx from Norfolk, the Commercial Man's Bull Sale, is coming up on February 5th. And Barb is here to tell us a little bit about this year's sale. Barb, before we talk about some of the entries in this year's production sale, maybe let's just talk a little bit about your family history. You guys are long time in, in the cattle business and really strive to develop long-term quality for the cattlemen. Huh? Well, I actually grew up uh, in the Sand Hills of Nebraska on a uh, cow calf operation. Um, we, I guess, we did have a feedlot, a back, backgrounding program, and Wayne grew up in uh, Northwest Iowa. So we have always been in agriculture and always been in the cattle business, and and it's, I guess, it's just been our life and in our livelihood. And uh, I don't want to say we don't know anything different, but that is where our passion lies. Barb, when you start uh, looking at putting together genetics, you're looking, you know, far into the future. The uh, the animals that are going to be on this year's sale, you know, you were thinking about that two or three years ago. What goes into that decision-making process when you're looking at uh, putting together a commercial man's bull sale? Well, we know our cows well, and we know that, uh, okay, does this cow need to be tweaked this way, that way? Uh, you know, basically, we want all of our cows to to... Kind of, I don't want to say we want them to look the same, but they've got to, they've all got to perform. They've all, it's not just to, not just to have a calf. They, those calves have got to be something of some quality. They've got to weigh some pounds. They've got to have some look, but uh, they've also got to have some bloodlines behind them that uh, they can pass on to their next generation. Um, disposition is super important to Wayne and Barb. Um, gainability, just to, Mothering ability, just overall quality from end to end is what we expect out of every single one of our uh, females that we have and all the progeny that they do produce. Barb, let's talk about this year's offering. You are telling me the bulls this year, a lot of diversity on the February 5th sale. Tell me about that. Well, we try to, uh, we're, we are not just uh, breeders of uh, one specific breed. Yes, we have some of our favorites, I guess, if you want to call it that. But we like to have something we can offer to everyone. We've got uh, some really high-quality Angus bulls. We've got some semi-Angus bulls, some uh, semi-bulls that are a little higher percentage. But we've got key main bulls. We've got uh, a Charlet bull. It's it's just fun to to raise quality. It doesn't matter what breed. The, we're all in the beef business. It doesn't matter what breed we have. We just want quality to offer or whatever your program is and whatever your needs are. Yeah, you talk about those programs and those goals that the uh, the people that you work with, some of the goals they might have. If they're looking for a calving ease bull, you got that. If you're looking for uh, you know really hard carcass traits, you'd have that. Uh, just a you know kind of diversity out there, huh? It, it is, and, and it, likewise, it's just as important that uh, we have. Uh, I guess a lot of uh, a lot of our bulls when we when we made them and we're thinking about them, we're thinking of a lot of maternal because the maternal part, the cow, that's our factory. The factory has to be there first of all, and in to us, if uh, if that cow can raise a big calf, if she can do her job, that is uh, that's what we want to want to have happen. When and I run. 140 head of cows, and we do expect all 140 of our cows to be good. They don't stay around if they don't uh, if they don't produce a good one. We'll give them a chance or two, but we want to when when you buy a bull from us, we want them to be the best that we can possibly make them to take your herd to the next level. Also, yep. The commercial man's bull sale again is on Friday, February 5th at their facility at Norfolk. Uh, Barb, if folks would like to take a look at this year's bulls and see what's available, can they uh, peruse through some of the listings online? They sure can. We uh, actually, we in the fall we have two uh, online female sales. And uh, likewise, in the uh, for the up- upcoming bull sale on showcircuit.com, we list them up there. Their uh, their pictures and their videos are there that you can see them. Or you can also go to allrix.com. Wayne and Barb sometimes forget to. Uh, we we know we've got our livestock. We know we've got our cattle. We know we we know them really well. We're always outside with them. Sometimes we forget to uh, get everything up online. You know. Uh, and the way we need to do it. So you can also, you can go to allworks.com or go to showcircuit.com and look at those bulls and, and see them there. Or you can stop at our place anytime you would, uh, would like to. Just give us a shout and tell us you're going to stop in. Just so there's no confusion, spell that last name so we get the website right. It is O 
H L R I C H S. Make sure there's an S on the end of it. Ulrichs.com. All right. Very good. Again, the uh, Commercial Man's Bull Sale coming up uh, February 5th at the facility at Norfolk. And uh, Barb, just as we kind of wrap up here, uh, again, a diverse set of bulls for um, uh, for this year's sale and uh, for all types like you. And it kind of goes back to why you named this the Commercial Man's Bull Sale. Wrap up with that thought. I tell you what, the Commercial Man's Bull Sale, we have uh, it, all bulls. Obviously, their calf crop, they're, they're going to end up being weighed across the scale. Um, they're not just, uh, I know some people think, uh, maybe, you know, think we just have show cattle. That's not the case. They are not show cattle. We're in, we're in for quality, but we've got to have performance. They've got to have mothering ability. Um, Chad, I guess I don't want to forget, we do have a couple couple good friends of ours that have been uh, longtime uh, customers and consigners to our bull sale. The Dostals and and uh, Kane Warren, and we welcome those guys and, and their genetics because they try to stay on top of uh, stay on top of things with a lot of quality to offer to our bull sale. Also, all right, very good. Yeah, definitely don't want to forget about them, Barb. It's good to talk to you. Thanks for the information. Okay, Chad, you have a fantastic day, and uh, we wish everybody out here in the cattle business to uh, have likewise the same way. Absolutely. Let's uh, look ahead to a great 2021. Barb Ulrichs from Wayne and Barb Ulrich, uh, Norfolk, and the Commercial Man's Bull Sale. Again, it's uh, set your calendar. It's Friday, February 5th at their facility at Norfolk. Facility at Norfolk.